Hi everyone, it's Anitra here and I wanted to show you a project I made for a swap I'm in over at Your Paper Pantry, the vintage postcard swaps hosted by Elise and she's Lisey46 on YouTube. Um, and I just really like this uh, swap and the group of ladies that are in this uh, swap each time. And this month's theme was back to school which is perfect for me because I do have um, small children who, who are in school and preschool. So it'll be fun to get some of those uh, different postcards back. And for my postcard though, I went with like a lighter um, color scheme. I know with vintage we tend sometimes to go darker and, and I actually had the ABC Primer uh, paper pack from Graphic 45, but I came across um, a border sheet by October Afternoons and it had these letters on it and I thought it looked a lot like um, an elementary school classroom so I used that instead um, and I like the funner lighter color that um, it came out in this color scheme um, but I, like I said I put it on the top because it reminded me of um, an elementary school classroom and this is actually a chalkboard I made by using a wooden rectangle from Michaels. I just, yeah, it's back in the wooden bin. And that was perfect. I just sprayed it with some chalkboard spray paint a few times. So this is actual little chalkboard. And then I just stuck a little uh, edge cut, uh, edge punch here, a little zigzag. This one's by EK Success. And then I found um, a digital image sheet from the Vintage Remix, and it's an Etsy store. And she sell, sold these uh, labels, and each label had like a little scene of children at, at a school or schoolroom environment. And on the labels it said, property of, so I suppose you could print them out, the labels, and, and write your name on them. But for me, I just, I just use the, I just fussy cut the little image of the children in their different settings. And this says Fun Times. I just stuck that up, that banner on there. And this is also from October Afternoon. It was one of their um, little die cut packs that came, that coordinated with this sidewalk collection. And then I tied a, tied a little seam binding bow. Um, you can hear a lot of aircrafts. They're doing um, training and I've been hearing them all day but um, so sorry if you hear that and on the back uh, I just stamped postcard and that's a Tim Holtz stamp and each one's a little different this one um, is going to Lisey and I packed up the ones that I'm going to swap out and each one's a little different so they have a glare on them because they're already packaged ready to go I don't know if you could see that but that little banner says best friends and there's like a um, a little scene of a, a boy and a girl at a desk and then the back um, is the same but I just added my information on the label this is one of the labels that was in the set and right here I had set this is where it said property of but that's where I opened it up in Photoshop and I just changed it to say back to school it's just held on there with the little mini clothespin and then this is another one that's slightly different. I thought I adhered her to this side of the, the teacher, to the blackboard. And there she's teaching her kids who are so eager to learn. Look how their little arms are raised. And that little banner just says, School Rules. And a different color seam binding bow. And the backs are the same. And then there's this one. This one says school rules also. And this teacher helping. And the back is the same. And that does it for my swaps. They're all ready to go. I just need to um, package Lisey's up and send them off. So I'm looking forward to see what I, I get back. Like I said, there's um, a group of ladies who do just an amazing job on these postcards and I really I really like um, getting them back let me show you sorry about that um, and I like getting these postcards back because um, I like making these minis 
And this is one I had made, well, a, a duplicate of one I had made for my dad um, for Father's Day. I just made another one because I also have a father-in-law and I didn't know if he would like it or not, so I held on to it. Um, but I put my postcards, they look fine in here, these little minis. So this is the one I had made, um, and, it, and I think the first vintage postcard um, swap I had joined, and it just, it just, I thought it looked really cute, so um, I thought it would be fun to make a mini of um, my son's uh, year this year at elementary school, and and I thought that would be a great little thing to put in a pocket, or um, adhere it to the binding. So I'm really looking forward to see what I get back. Like I said, it was a talented group of ladies, and I, I really enjoy this swap. So that does it for me with this project. Uh, I'm going to try and put up my pocket for your thoughts, but I have to get the information first because I don't really recall where I got everything. But anyway, thanks for watching. Bye.